I probably shouldn't admit it, but I usually go directly to Wikipedia. I use the citations and links at the bottom of the page as a jumping off point to sources I can use in my paper. Wikipedia is the very beginning of the very beginning for me. It's my pre-search tool. It gives me background and an overview, especially for a class paper. Wikipedia? It's a great place to start and a horrible place to end. At least, that's what my professor says. If I'm looking for some information I need for a class, or for whatever, I'll go to some person for an answer, a teaching fellow, a professor, my roommate, that is, if they are closer than my computer is. For assignments, I'll use a librarian, especially, to find stuff that matches my thesis statement, and that's good. But you have to remember, librarians aren't giving you the final grade on the assignment. I rely on librarians for learning how to navigate the complexity of using libraries here, just to be able to get around and find things. What's so frustrating to me about conducting research is the more you know, the more you realize how little you know. I expect everything to be at my fingertips on the web, but it's not. I need to find good content I can use in a hurry. I'm a first-generation student. My mother can help with commas and spelling. But what would she know about the Algerian war? College is about knowing how to look at a problem in multiple ways and how to think about it analytically. That's something I'll use in my life. I'm not just a consumer of information anymore. After being here for three years, I just don't take everything I come across at face value. I've found out how to narrow things down now. Sort through the information, take what I need, and throw out the rest of the junk. I'll use that in after I leave here. From here, what will I take with me? I've learned to take the initiative to ask a question and how to ask it. And I've got the will and determination to get the information I need to find an answer. 